Welcome back to the channel, everybody. Deer hunting, turkey hunting. Depending on what comes in, will depend on what I shoot. Seen a ton of turkeys come through here. My stand, somewhere right here. Unfortunately, the shot from there to here is probably 60 yards, touch too far. So what we've done, scooted over, seeing deer run along the creek over here, seeing turkeys over here almost every day. So deer and turkey, those are our two objectives for today. Let's see if we can get it done. Set up. It's really nice because this blind has this mesh, so I can put it up so you can't see me. And then right when I'm ready to shoot, I just sit my bow right there. Boom, I'm shooting out that hole. Hopefully we see some stuff tonight. We'll just see what happens. So wish me luck and stay tuned. What a cluster. There's my first arrow. Snapped it right off. Second arrow hit. Got the wings. Third arrow. Probably not necessary, but just finished the deal, sealed the deal. Oh, so thankful to have a turkey down. Good deal. Let's get out of here. Heck yes. We have a bird on the ground. So, just like I had set, said, kind of predicted, this is the weirdest thing ever. I had at least two does come in. The first one, I was going to shoot if it took like three more steps. But then I was looking right behind her and I was like... Gosh dang it, there's turkeys. And I've been dying to get a turkey. I've got ample time to get deer this year. This will probably be my last day to deer hunt this year. 
Here's my arrow that hit the turkey. Let's see what we got. Oh yeah. Rod head opened. Plenty of blood. I got paranoid for a second because I was afraid all I did was get the wings. And if I get the wings, these things are still fast, so I never would have made, never would have been able to catch up to it. So I found it. Still had his head up, unfortunately. Took the third shot. Uh, not necessary by any means, but it did finish that bird, so I'm pretty excited. Got us a nice turkey. Now, this area I'm hunting, I know I probably demolished it tonight, but I think I'm taking three weeks off from here. That's a long time. Let this place breathe out, let everything calm down a little bit, and then come back with a vengeance, come rut, and pray for the deer, because my goal is to get at least two, possibly three this year. Um, need to get one buck, one nice doe. The minimum, I don't really care. I got to get at least one deer just to put in the freezer. The rest is bonus. Extra meat's always nice. You can donate, give to friends and family. So excited about that. But we got one bird on the ground. Check this guy out, everybody. Just a nice little hen. Not a super old bird, but you know, I'll take it. Another just terrible looking fan. I don't even know what to do with the mount on this. Rough. I don't know what it is, but it seems like half the turkeys you get are in immaculate shape and the other half are subpar. This is my first hen that's not bearded. So, still pretty neat. Um, looks like I got it right through the bottom. Touch low. Uh, these things are really hard to shoot. I know it's kind of weird, but this is like a very large chicken. It's not really a, a big turkey. If I had some bearded toms come in, definitely could have been a game changer. The crazy thing is, is I've been watching these birds for probably two weekends now, just in and out, same spot every single time. It's routine. And I am yet to see one tom. Every bird is a nice hen, which is, don't get me wrong, I'm more than thankful for that. I'm excited to get a hen. So we're going to start packing up. We're going to head back. I'll probably show you guys a little bit more on the way out, but I'm excited. We got us a bird. Heck yes. Yes. This blind, as simple as it is, has killed lots of animals out of it. A couple different turkeys, a couple different deer. It's been a lot more essential to my hunting than I could ever imagine. Oh, fun fact. I just thought about this as I about dropped my bow. I dropped my bow on the way in here, which could very well be why. I missed that turkey because basically the turkey is probably about that much meat. It's about six inches and I just skimmed the top of it. The turkey was like, what the hell was that? I just kept on going. Another bird down. Exciting stuff. Just a little hen. Pretty cool looking bird though. Another incredible turkey. So blessed to be able to get one of these guys. I am uh, pretty excited. Not a real big fan on it. Might do just a, a little decoy mount or something. Still not bad, pretty neat. Definitely gonna be adding it to the collection of fans. So thanks for watching guys. I hope you enjoyed and we'll catch you on the next one. Peace.